I don't think that thing is moving. How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some mysterious things caught on camera. But as always, before we dive in, remember to hit that subscribe button and get ready for more creepy content. Just like this. The thought of having a poltergeist in your home is terrifying. Although it's said that poltergeists aren't always violent, these spirits can still supposedly torment their victims by making noises and moving objects. YouTuber Sylvia C began noticing strange occurrences in her home after playing with a Ouija board at her kitchen table. She claims that her channel documents some of the activity that has since occurred. In this clip, it's fairly obvious that whatever is present wants to make itself known. I have to put the camera on of activity tonight in the kitchen. Keep an eye on the cupboard door. It swings open, then shuts. Next, watch what happens when the woman asks, do you want me out of your house? Do you want me out of this house or do you want me to stay? The presence appears to answer by moving a can on the kitchen counter. The poster explains that this kind of thing happens in her kitchen all the time. This is evidenced in the next clip which shows the poster hiding behind a partition while pointing the camera towards the sink. Oh my god, the spirit's moving, oh my god, did you see that? Oh my Oh that nice, oh no, it's moving now. You can see a spoon and fork moving by themselves. Oh my god, the spoon's moving. Oh, that knife's, that knife's moving now. She shows the area beneath the counter to demonstrate there are no magnets or strings. There's nothing. I'm not faking this. Look, there's nobody under there. There's nobody under the counter, or under the fridge. There's no magnets or anything like that. There's no strings. That's been moved itself. The woman's voice clearly sounds distressed throughout the footage. Oh my God. The that spoon's moving, oh my god, did you see that? Oh my Oh, that knife's, that knife's moving now. Oh. So would you try and communicate with a poltergeist? Or would you just pack your bags and leave? The pot isn't moving again. Well, it's official thanks to today's sponsor, Established Titles, I'm now officially a lord. And henceforth I shall rule the will of the people with an iron fist. Just like this. But seriously, if you're wondering how I became a lord, well that's exactly what Established Titles do. They appoint you a lord or lady. According to a historic Scottish custom, many landowners are referred to as lairds, or lords and ladies in English. So by buying even just a tiny piece of land, usually around one square foot, you too can become a lord or lady. Their title packs give you at least one square foot of land on a private estate in Eddleston, Scotland, and an official certificate with a crest. This certificate features a unique plot number with which you can see the exact location of your land. And what's cool is, not only do you become a lord or lady, established titles will also plant a tree with every order to help protect the pristine and biodiverse woodlands of Scotland. They work closely with global charities like One Tree Planted and Trees for the Future to help afforestation efforts. These make amazing last minute gifts. You can make your partner, a family member or friend a lord or lady almost instantly. Now established titles have told me the first 200 people purchasing a title pack using my special link will effectively be next to my plot within a few minutes walking distance. Depending on how many of you want to become a lord or lady right now, we can build out a little slaptam kingdom right there in Scotland. So established titles are having a huge Labor Day sale on right now. Plus, if you use the code SLAPTAM at checkout, you'll get an additional 10% off your entire order. So head to establishedtitles.com forward slash slapped ham 
That's establishedtitles.com forward slash slaptam. Get 10% off your entire order. Plus, you'll be supporting our channel. YouTuber Dark Ghost Paranormal explores places that most people would never dare. As this clip begins, he explains that he was sent the coordinates to this house in the mail. The sender claimed that elderly people used to live there and that they were plagued by strange activity, especially in the basement. The residents supposedly heard unusual sounds, disembodied conversations, and even saw doors opening by themselves throughout the home. After the owners passed away, the house was left to relatives. However, they never moved in, and it's remained empty ever since. In the video, we see the investigator thoroughly exploring the space with a flashlight as he sets up some cameras to record in the background. This is when things start to get a little creepy. A piece of glass slides off the counter and shatters on the floor. Then the entire room starts to rumble and shake, tossing other objects around. It doesn't appear to be an earthquake because it doesn't affect the rest of the house. Next, the investigator uses a device in an attempt to contact any resident spirits. Eerily, he receives a message telling him to open the basement. Bravely, or perhaps stupidly, he decides to do it. He opens the hatch and ventures cautiously into the darkness. Suddenly, something catches him off guard. Take a listen. It sounds like an eerie screech. Unwilling to find out who or what made the noise, he wisely leaves the basement. However, it seems that his curiosity soon gets the better of him and he lowers himself through the trapdoor one more time. Sure enough, the same spine-chilling sound emanates out of the darkness. <laughs> This time he doesn't hesitate, he quickly packs his equipment and leaves the property. While hanging out at a friend's house, Redditor Peppermint the Fox caught something strange on camera. Take a look. The large white object is a propane tank. There's also something else right next to it. At first, it's hard to make out what exactly it could be. It looks like it might be part of the tank, but if you zoom in, you can see that the foggy shape appears to have a head perched on top of a large frame. It even has two sparkling eyes that are looking off to the side. Many viewers thought the figure resembled a gorilla, while others suggested it might be a human attempting to steal propane from the tank. The original poster added that the figure vanished right after the photo was taken, and upon further inspection, they could see no footprints or signs of any kind that the figure was even there. So is this photo proof of a mysterious cryptid roaming the area, 
or is it something else entirely? Perhaps pareidolia? Take another look at the image and let me know what your theories are in the comments down below. Abandoned places often have complex histories and the dilapidated building seen in this video is no exception. Many people have reported strange incidents here. It's even thought that one individual committed suicide in a downstairs room. YouTuber Mysterio JL decides to investigate the premises for himself. As he enters the first room, he and his partner hear footsteps. They dissipate as the men walk closer, but can be heard once again as the men turn away. That's when they discover the word Nino, which means little boy in Spanish, written on the wall. The investigators decide to continue their exploration of the property. As something grabs their attention, the camera holder inadvertently captures something unnerving on camera. A mysterious figure can be seen in the top right window. At first, it's almost impossible to see. However, if you brighten the footage, it becomes more obvious. Next, they head upstairs. As they make their way along a dark, dilapidated hallway, a chilling sound echoes through the space. According to the uploader, the voice says Mama in Spanish. Not long after, the investigators catch a second sighting of the mysterious figure they saw earlier. Again, the footage needs to be brightened up, but as before, there's definitely something there. Is this just a squatter who's taken up residence in the crumbling building? Or could it be the spirit of a child that's calling out for their mama? Oi. Are we alone in the universe? UFO sightings have been recorded across the globe for centuries. This video, uploaded to YouTube by Arslan Warwick, is supposedly the longest ever UFO recording made by a civilian. Take a look. The camera holder notes that the orb-like object is difficult to see with the naked eye. Oh, it's very hard to see with the naked eye now. Sun has set. It's practically almost dark now. Luckily, he has an excellent camera with a powerful zoom. 9x, this is what iPhone's maximum zoom is. I don't think that thing is moving. After some time, it appears as though it's actually hovering in place. It's just sitting there. If it was just a kite, which has been suggested, it would move more noticeably in the wind. So this thing has been here for the past one hour, as I've said before. 
Just here. At the very end of the recording, there are several still images of the object. Here we can see that it has a distinctive dome shape, unlike any man-made craft. Many viewers have praised the camera holder for their high quality video work. Usually UFO footage is grainy and out of focus, making it difficult to get a good look at the actual object. Several viewers also mentioned that they too have seen similar objects in the sky recently. Have you ever witnessed a UFO? If so, let us know your experience in the comments down below. This next video, posted to TikTok by Scary Central, isn't supernatural at all, yet yeah, it'll likely leave you unnerved. As the clip begins, the camera's focused on a patch of dirt or sand. There's not much to see until a paintbrush comes into view and begins to gently tap at the dirt. Take a look at what happens next. If you're not a fan of creepy crawlies, you've probably turned away. If you haven't, however, you've noticed how big the spider is compared to the paintbrush. This is supposedly a Sicaria spider, a type of arachnid that buries itself in the sand and waits to surprise its prey. The name in Latin means assassin and its bite can be seriously dangerous to humans. Just think next time you go outside, this little guy could be right next to your foot and you wouldn't even know. Before we take a look at a strange little clip of unknown origins, remember to hit that subscribe button, then tickle that little bell icon there and turn on all channel notifications. That way you'll be notified every time we drop our scary and creepy videos. There's very little information available on this next video. It was uploaded to TikTok by Scary Central, but its origins are unknown. It shows a woman chatting on her cell phone as she walks by. She stops momentarily to say something to the camera holder, oblivious to the fact that there might be danger in the vicinity. Take a look at what happens next. A creepy figure appears behind her. It lurches out of the darkness, reaching towards the unsuspecting woman. <laughs> the camera holder does see it, however. Panicked, they don't even attempt to warn their friend of the impending threat. They simply run away. As there's little information on this video, it's hard to tell just what it is we're seeing here. The figure looks distorted, almost as if it could be a reflection in a warped mirror. Take another look at the clip and let me know what you think's going on here. Is it a snippet from a movie or is it something a little more sinister? Let me know down below. <laughs> If you love mysterious videos like this one, then check out our other content. There's an episode there. Otherwise, there's a massive paranormal playlist right there that'll keep you entertained. Now, remember to follow us on all our other socials as well. There's links in the description box below. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time.